I entered the Jiu Jitsu tournament and ended up winning $100, which is $100 more than they usually win. My first match was a fast one. I hit an arm drag and started climbing onto his back. I get a rear naked choke and start squeezing. Sir, could you please tap? But I see it's not there, so I wait for my moment to go for the choke. I get it locked in and I start squeezing as I bring my elbow back to get the submission by rear naked choke. After that quick win, I was feeling confident, but in my next match, I'd be facing Alejandra, a really agile blue belt. I grab a two-on-one, and when he pulls back, I hit an ankle pick. I lift his leg up and start going for the trip, but he has a good base. He drops down to a knee, but before I can get to his back, he pummels in an underhook. He brings his weight forward, and I start going for a butterfly sweep, but I don't finish it since I don't want to be a jerk. I go shin on shin, then I lift his leg up and go to the single leg X. I turn my knees out to the side and start bridging back for the straight ankle. He's able to take my foot off his hip, which removes the pressure, so I just come up instead. I bring my knee across and start going for a knee slice. From here, it's a battle to see who gets the underhook. Luckily, I'm the one that gets it. I donkey kick to get my ankle free. I start going for a spinning armbar. I push his head down, step over, and start falling back for the armbar. But he's able to hit a hitchhiker escape. Bruh. Honestly, I could have hipped in more, but I wanted to give him time to tap. But he has some good escapes, so next time, I knew I had to go harder. He immediately starts putting on some passing pressure, but I'm able to bring his head over his elbow and hit a butterfly sweep. He defends, so I go for a guillotine, but he rolls under into deep half guard. Let me tell you guys something. I hate deep half guard. So I just let him get the sweep because I don't want to be stuck there. I lift him up and go to single leg X, and I try hitting a belly down straight ankle, but his heel slips out. So I try wrestling up, he does a good job defending, so I pull guard and invert under him. I try looking for a leg lock from here, but he steps out and starts working to pass my guard. I'm asking myself, what the heck is a tiny cup? Watch out, watch out, watch out! Oh! That's a tiny cup. I off balance him and I give him a big hug. Because we all need a hug sometimes. Aww. Psych? Never let someone give you a hug. That's double underhooks right there. You can't be giving up inside position like that. Notice how I pummel my foot to make sure it doesn't get trapped between Alejandro's legs. For a while, he keeps trying to trap my ankle between his legs. So I just keep it tucked, so I don't get stuck in his quarter guard. He bridges over and over again in an attempt to escape, but I just keep holding as tight as I can. I'm just waiting for my opportunity to go for a submission. And before I know it, I get that opportunity. As he gives a strong bridge, which gives me a chance to go for... Another spinning armbar. And this time, I'm able to get the tap. Good job, good fight boys. Let's give it up for Josh. I was about to go into my final match against Khalil, an athletic blue belt that won his last two matches by fast submission. Yeah. Are you guys ready? I like to use my advantage, so. <laughs> Fuck. Every person in the tournament was granted an advantage that they could use at any point. With this, I'm able to pick a random position and start from there. A few matches ago, someone started in the rear naked choke. What would I get? Advantage. Single X. Okay. Not bad. Single leg X. This is good, but not game changing. We get reset in our position, and all I can think about is how close his leg is. Because I know that if I can grab it, I get a guaranteed sweep. And I do. And I come on top. But Khalil's able to big brother me and just get back up. I could tell that this match wasn't going to be easy. Khalil's coach starts giving him some advice. I don't want your hands on the floor. I want your hands on his face. I want your hands on his chest. I don't want you smashing on him. I try going to single leg X, but Khalil's having none of that. No! I go for a dummy sweep, and as he comes forward, I elevate him and go for a leg lock. I start coming up to get the sweep, and I notice his back's off the mat, so I lock up the body lock. I now have a body lock with one leg inside. This is my favorite position to pass from. I bring my knee across, but he bridges, so I climb up to mount instead. I walk his arm up, and he bridges again, which gives me the opportunity to lock up a gift wrap and take his back. I trap his arm and start going for the choke, but I rush it. And he's able to push my foot off his hip and escape. I hit another single leg X sweep. But I feel him grab my leg, so I just get the heck out of there. Because I don't want to get knee barred like his last opponent did. The tides of the match start to turn, as Khalil really tries to pass my guard.
At three minutes, halfway through the match. I tried going for an Aoki lock, but he slips out. Khalil gets double unders and makes me seriously appreciate how flexible I am. I put in a butterfly hook and hit a butterfly sweep. I still haven't gotten the sub, so I just start going for anything I see. I go for a toe hold, but he defends, so I start knee slicing and looking for a darse. I put on some cross face pressure and pass his guard. I start looking for a submission from Neon Belly, but my man Khalil is pretty explosive and is able to bump me off. I try threatening a guillotine, but Khalil spins out of it, leaving me on bottom. Time was running out, and I want to get the submission. I had to go for something. 20 seconds. It's 7 to 1. The arm drag by Josh. Flashy going for the back. Can he get the hook in for the points? That is a negative. Six. Three, two, one. Time. Right. Right as he gets the rear naked locked in. Just like that, I won the match on points and got $100 all in ones. Guys, make sure you like and subscribe and uh, hit that bell notification. Also, if you're trying to see the full tournament, Check out Jedi's video on it, link in the description.